Hello everyone, welcome to our first video to beginner's guide on how to Revit. In this video, I'll explain how to open your first Revit template as well as setting up our unit of measurement. The default is usually imperial, but let's use metric instead. In the home page of Revit, we're going to click new, browse, go up one folder level, look for the English only folder, and look for default metric template, which is this one. Open and OK. Now, it's a good practice to set up our units before act doing actual modeling. Convert all imperial to metric. Cost per square foot to be converted to cost per square meter. Fit to in two millimeters. Okay. Next, we gotta move our elevation element away from the center to avoid any cuts if our model clash with its view since the sole purpose of elevation element is to show an overall view of the model from different direction. We're going to be using the move command. Let's move them apart by 50,000 millimeter. Now, you can press ZX or double-click the mouse button for zoom extend or zoom to fit. As you see, the objects appear smaller because we move them away from each other. Next, we will use the element hide command to hide them. Take note, we just hid the elevation. We didn't actually delete them. We can return them to this layout by going to the reveal hidden element command. This pink border here is the warning sign that we're in the reveal hidden elements window. Now, we're going to reselect our elevation objects. Now, we're going to unhide them. And we're going to toggle off the reveal hidden elements mode. Now, as you see, they're back in their original state. But like I said, we, got, we really got to hide them to avoid any problems of deleting them by mistake. And that's it for our first video. Next, we will be laying out some grids. For questions and suggestions, please do comment below and please don't forget to like and subscribe. It will help me a lot. I will see you in the next video. Thank you.